as the morning wears on into the afternoon, those temperatures to the north and west will gradually warm up. So even our far northwestern cities and counties will see plain rain by this afternoon. Elsewhere, just some periods of heavy rain highs this afternoon between about 45 and 50 in the metro, some 50s to the southeast, but we'll stay in the 30s north and west. And then all of this is out of here by about 5, 6, 7 p.m. tonight. We will see the clouds breaking up tonight and tomorrow morning temperatures will be near or below freezing. So anything that doesn't dry up tonight, anything that's left over like more Moisture on sidewalks or driveways or untreated road surfaces could be a little bit icy tomorrow, not from anything that's falling, but the stuff that's already on the ground. And then we'll see some sunshine for tomorrow afternoon with highs in the upper 40s and low 50s. There's a winter weather advisory west of I-95. There's a winter storm warning out by I-81. So the farther west you go, the better chance you have of seeing some slick conditions. We've already had some road reports of some icy weather well west of I-95. And the worst ice accumulations could be as you get closer to I-81. And there'll even be a little bit of snow there are up in the mountains, especially uh, as you get closer to uh, I-81, where they could see an excess of three inches of snow. But for us, maybe a few snowflakes or sleep pelts. Most of this will be freezing rain, changing to plain rain. Tomorrow will be breezy and dry. We'll have a high temperature of 52, 50 on Monday. Another storm brings us a good soaking rain on Tuesday. Then we watch another system for late Friday and Saturday. Stay with CBS 6, the Weather Authority.